Welcome back to Decentralized News. In today's uh, video, we want to touch on Elastos, which is a project that has a token with the ticker ELA. Currently, it is available for trading on KuCoin, YB, Pionex, and uh, several other exchanges. You can always go to decentralized.news for the best cryptocurrency exchange reviews, DeFi platform reviews, and uh, a whole lot more. Also, don't forget to you know, like and subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. So what is Elastos ELA token? It is uh, a project that is aiming to be a blockchain powered version of the internet. Essentially the project is uh, one that actually originated way back to the year, sort of 2000 before even uh, blockchain came back on the scene. The current version is a blockchain based um, program uh, that is uh, actually uh, something that they launched only in uh, 2017 and uh, the team behind it believe that Ethereum as well as uh, decentralized application platforms sort of uh, lack uh, limitations when it comes to scaling and uh, they are obviously looking to provide some solutions within that niche so they say that obviously the Ethereum is great for smart contracts but they're slow and uh, inconvenient for full applications and uh, the Elastos is a platform for decentralized applications or dApps that claims to actually solve many of those limitations so with uh, Elastos aside from the fact that you know users gain full ownership of their digital assets you also don't actually have to have to have access to the internet in order to run your dApps all dApps run on the smart web and uh, the idea behind the smart web is to pretty much protect you from malware or other digital attacks that uh, expose you to data theft and the platform is extremely optimized for mobile and you can also run the network dApps on uh, pretty much every operating system that is uh, currently out there so this is a project that I think you know I've seen it around the space for quite some time I've never really held the the token ELA myself but I think it's one that I'm just going to do a little bit of a deeper dive in to see what it is that they offer. But what makes their project unique is obviously the four pillars that enable network separation as well as platform flexibility. So these are sort of our blockchain, our runtime, carrier and also software development kit or SDK. So the blockchain separates app functionality between the main chain and side chains for each individual application. The runtime also gives you flexibility to run these dApps outside of the Elastos operating system altogether. And uh, the career or carrier is a peer-to-peer -peer decentralized uh, internet service where you're able to rent out your computational power and storage to other users as well. So the development kit connects applications to the smart web that is uh, beneficial to non-Elastos applications. And the Elast OS application itself is supposed to bring the entire decentralized ecosystem into an app so the flagship product of uh, elastos smart web is um, obviously has the entire decentralized ecosystem all put into one application like i said you know this is a project that is very interesting when it comes to how the network is secured um, all the communication on the network is encrypted and authorized by blockchain ids these IDs also in turn determine how the data is processed and who has access to it. Through the system, only users can uh, choose if they want to sell their data or preserve their actual privacy. So through a combination of Elastos runtime, dApps uh, are provided with uh, trusted uh, network communication as well. So this means Elastos is a decentralized internet and dApp platform that gives you, the user, complete control over your digital assets. It is intended to improve the scalability and flexibility issues as well of other networks while it explicitly uh, built uh, for dApp performance. So you can trade the asset on a, a Bittrex, it's available on Wabi, KuCoin, etc. There's a link in the description to our ecosystems tab where you've got all of these platforms and also reviews to all of these exchanges. Let me know what you think if you're a hold of ELA. Let me know how it's performing for you right now. It's sitting just under $3 at about $2.80. And uh, yeah, I think I'll put it on my watch list. Let me see if uh, it's a good time to get into this one. But currently, I'm not a holder. So please do your own research. 
and also please like share subscribe turn on that notification bell check out links in the description to my books tokenized trillions and blockchain applied till next time peace y'all